So, so let's switch back to Mr. Beard over there. <laughs> Macho man. <laughs> so, so you know, I want to actually, I want you to talk about like a few minutes about okay. your longest trip in the history of, <laughs> of civilization. <laughs> yeah, I, I like. I was so fascinated. I would just keep logging on and watch him drive back from wherever the heck he <laughs> went. I don't even know. <laughs> yeah, well, thank you everybody who's joined in on those streams on the way back because that really and Mr. Flex's stream just helping me stay engaged with something so that I'm not getting sleepy or uh, having to take extra time to get home, even though I exited the wrong exit in Kansas. Don't do that. <laughs> Don't exit the wrong exit in Kansas because there's no turnaround for a hundred miles. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> okay. But so anyways, tell us, tell us how this started. So I ran into a person who was having trouble finding a way home from Colorado to Virginia um, because she is very anxious. Like she has so much anxiety that she can't be on a plane or a train or a bus because there's a too many people and it's too small of a space with that many people. So um, she offered me three thousand dollars to drive her fifteen hundred miles one way, and so I decided to ask Wifey for Lifey over here is if that was okay if she was okay with me driving not just to Virginia but driving a female to Virginia and she said thumbs up only be it. not because I was not worried about like it being a woman in his car because I totally trust Tony I was more afraid that she was going to be like some crazy serial killer yeah we were just got <laughs> done watching oh, like during the pandemic Kansas. yeah and dur yeah. during the pandemic we watched uh criminal mind so it's like everybody's a serial killer uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, so yeah so 1500 miles with an anxiety ridden woman in the back seat is that what's happening here? right she took her anxiety medication and she slept for like 25 of those hours whenever wow. i stopped to charge and it was late at night and i tried to get a nap she'd be that's when she's awake and she's like hey can we go can we go can we? i'm like can i get like <laughs> 10 minutes of sleep so we can get there <laughs> So round trip, this was round trip. What was this? Like three thousand plus miles, right? Yeah, it ended up being like thirty two hundred because of that wrong turn. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so for for three grand, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. Well, I mean, I'm I don't know, you know, I, a, I don't know. It ends up being about a dollar per mile, and yeah. you know, I could have probably asked her for more, but I wasn't trying to price gouge somebody because I'm trying to be like uber blacking somebody to Virginia, you know, like. I also am a helpful person and I'm like, you know, that's enough. I'm not trying to, I mean, a plane ride is like maybe $800, you know? So, yeah, I know. So mm -hmm. She must have really anxiety issues for to pay you three grand for that. Yeah. Like, wow. Yeah. Okay. And I'm sure she would have paid me more, but you know, I, so, my conscience wouldn't let me go further than that. I, I don't know about that as a capitalist. I don't know about that, but that's okay. <laughs> Even I'll, as I'll, a, I'll forgive you on that that's, one. I'll that's you. why I can't be the cutthroat capitalist like i can be I, you know i'll forgive like, you about that one that's okay uh, six right, grand so, would have been two dollars a mile but yeah easy easy Sergio, um, before, before we go on we got to do the thumbs up you and i uh yeah we'll do a countdown would you take that ride for three thousand for well we'll we'll just say it would have been three thousand per uh, round trip if we didn't right okay. I mean, turn in kansas it took me four days okay hold on hold on Four it days. Took me four days. I made yeah. seven hundred and fifty dollars a day by doing that. Okay. You know what? Now that he said that, see, I was for sure thumbs down. <laughs> but now that he's <laughs> and that was in that a way, Tesla. That was in a Tesla. Much, it would have been faster in a gas vehicle. And how and much, he was on autopilot ninety percent of the time on those highways, yeah. right? <laughs> yep. Okay. Now, you know what? I don't know, man. Is, okay. Here we hold go. On, hold on. We we need to know one more thing before we we do our thumbs up, thumbs down. Okay. Uh, how much was the charging cost by chance? Uh, 200 because I wanted to use the superchargers on the way out, but then the way back, I used my Electrify America account that I have free charging um, till March. So 200 uh, rounded up. Okay. But, okay. Hold yeah. worry, well, are these charges available in the middle of cornfields and shit? I mean, oops, yeah. sorry. <laughs> everywhere. You just type in your destination and it maps it out for you. Wow. Okay. Here we go. All right. I'm going. I'm, I'm, no, I'm two, one. Two, one. 
<laughs> all right. <Yeah. laughs> we agree. All right, I'm yeah, not an I, idiot. Yeah. You know, you got, right. me, you got me when you said 750 a day. You know what I mean? Because then I'm going like, initially I was like, not a chance on the planet. Then I'm maybe yeah. for 5K. But then when he said 750 a day, if I did ride share or anything else, I'm not going to make 750 a day. And plus, on the way back, you were on your own live streaming, right? Yeah. So I'm like, yeah, yeah, no, there you go. Thumbs up. Uh, yeah, yeah making a little I more. I did fun spend a hundred dollars on a, a hotel so I could take a shower and and change clothes <laughs> and stuff. But then the other sleeping, I bought a mattress topper and I just slept in the Tesla camp mode. Now, for that many hours, did she pay for food to eat for you? Um, no, I I didn't do that. No, she oh, okay. she probably would have, but she didn't. She ate candy, so I wasn't oh. about to be on the candy diet. <laughs> oh wow. <laughs> Wow. So would you okay? Last question would be: Would you do it again? Yes, I would. Okay, there you go. I probably, the same I probably, I probably up the price, maybe like yeah. five hundred more dollars. Yes, yes. Mm -hmm. Just to cover expenses. Okay. So I can net right. the three thousand. Yeah. So that yeah, I mean, I you know what? I think you came ahead on this deal seriously because you're in a rental. You're not worried about depreciation. Just you know, I'm like you're paying the weekly anyway, so that's like. I think, I, yeah. I yeah, think and I told the guy that I rent from, and he's like, man, that's awesome. <laughs> oh, okay, yeah, yeah. Do you have so no did mileage? you get good content for your channel? <laughs> yeah, there you go. No, I think I think that's awesome. So that's okay. All right, thanks for watching. That short little clip was from our live stream, Show Me the Money Club with Sergio and myself, Tuesdays, 6 p.m. Eastern, 3 p.m. Pacific. Make sure you subscribe, turn on all notifications so you'll be notified when we go live, as well as all of our awesome content. Make sure to check out this video right here, which will take you to the entire live stream, or check out this video right there. All right, drive smart, everyone. <laughs>